Hey y'all, what's up? It's snow and it's Saturday and today I woke up, I was feeling great and I haven't felt great in a very long time and I haven't filmed in a very long time. So what we're gonna do today is not stress myself out about filming but also enjoy the day it is sunny outside whoop, whoop. it's been like like damn near freezing in dallas but today y'all gonna roll with me i'm gonna try to get some um uh, little filming here and there i need to drop off a prescription i need to get my inspection my car inspection done get my car inspection sticker because it goes out as of today and then I think I'm gonna take a little trip to Waxahachie um, and go shopping. So y'all come on with me and we'll chit chat in between the in-betweens, okay? Let's have fun, happy Saturday. <laughs> with them stickers them stickers cost a lot of money and it is an investment and so i just had didn't have the energy to really play with my stickers correctly and respectfully you know what i'm saying so i ain't been playing in stickers and i haven't really been in my planner so i had to find ways to like really get stuff done and i found that i could still get stuff done without a sticker um and all my planners but i'm eventually going to get back in my planner because it's kind of like a hobby it's something that i do and it's something that brings joy in my life so i don't know if i'm gonna get back in my a5 so quickly but i'm still in like my um my daily planner for work and i just found a um hold on y'all i'm trying to move up into this inspection thing hold on Oh, keep going, he said. I didn't want to roll over the kitty. No, you good, you good. I just need my inspection. State inspection? Yeah. Okay. I just need your insurance questions. Okay, hold on. All right, y'all. That man threw me off. He came up to my window, y'all, with no mask, just like talking to him in my face. And I was like, oh my God, it's still Corona. Like, that kind of scared me. Y'all see what I'm talking about? It's the first time that I'm out and about. And that's the first thing that hits me. A man coming up to me like he was all in my window. Lord, I plead the blood over myself. Hmm. <laughs> okay. But back to the A5. So the A5 just takes a lot of my time setting it up, keeping it together. And um, I just don't have time for that at this current moment. So I'm just going to be working in my daily planner and using my calendar on my phone. And I also downloaded a... I downloaded like a digital planner and it syncs with my calendar and I can like make tasks and just keep up with everything. So yeah, that's what's going on with the planning on the planning side. And when I come back y'all like faithfully with like my weekly videos, whatever, it's probably not going to be, it's not going to be mm, solo dolo planning because just not feeling that anymore and i'm allowed to grow all oh, the cars i'm allowed to grow you know what i'm saying so i don't know what my channel will partake of it still will be planning but i just wouldn't say i have a planning channel you know what i'm saying so yeah i'm so glad i got in here before everybody um it's people are starting to roll in now so 
I'm glad I came. Keep your mask on, cause people acting like this thing ain't still here, and it's still here. I'm really low key mad that that man came to me with no mask on. Disrespectful. I should sue. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Oh, we don't have the service anymore now. What? Kroger's up. I can go to Kroger's. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, this shout out to my Kiki. Mm -hmm. That baby about to drop. Woo, 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 woo. Oh, yeah. Back on the scene, that's the day. That's the model of today. Back up on the scene. machine is down i'm over it over it i'm about to get this mcdonald's and i forgot there's a car wash over here can y'all see me <laughs> the sun want to hit that melanin Ooh. <laughs> but um so yeah i'm about to get me a fish fillet sandwich uh mcdonald's better be having lunch because i can't take any more l's ketchup ketchup Ten. Any ketchup, girl? If you don't uh, dip your hand, I work at McDonald's for years. If you don't dip your hand in that little container and give me some ketchup, girl, it's not your ketchup, girl. Out done. You tried it. She tried it. How many, girl? If Saturday don't keep trying me, Saturday want me to take my butt home. It do. It has to want me to take my butt home because how many ketchups, girl, how many ketchups do you need for your sandwich and your french fries? All oh, this car wash line, I'm done with lines. Sorry, what you doing? I'm done with lines. You turning and we just gonna stop and put all this ketchup on my sandwich and eat my sandwich and I can drive and eat the fries. I'm about to literally pull over and eat my sandwich before I get on this road to Waxahachie. It's your ketchup! Ooh, Snow, let it go, girl. Let it go. I can't go. I'll let it go after I eat the sandwich. Pull up under this tree real quick, eat my sandwich. <laughs> but before I do, let's sanitize again. How many times y'all gonna see me sanitize today? This is alcohol. Isoprofol. Okay. How many ketchups? Get out of my face! Get out of my face. I'm talking about how many. Y'all, so I only asked for ketchup on my fish fillets. I've been eating fish fillets since I was a little sprout. Since I was a little, a little kid. And it usually comes with um, cheese and tartar sauce but i don't care for either one so i have them put ketchup on it and they only put ketchup on one bun i would know because i worked at mcdonald's for years now, hold on let me pray oh it's fresh it's so fresh wow i was about to put my mouth on that and that's another thing i just sanitized but then she touched it and now i'm touching it I can't get away from Corona! Girl, for no reason. Don't ask me how many ketchups I need. 
just give me some ketchup. Mm. This tea, I believe, is 80% sugar and 20% tea. I believe. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's hop on the road. All right, bye, y'all. We're at store number uno. Let's look at bilk. I don't know what I'm really looking for. I'm still on the hunt for clothes that are my size because like right now I'm wearing a shirt and my whole belly is too small. So my belly keeps popping out. I really need work clothes, but I'm praying that God will send us all back home. So I don't want to buy work clothes. I want to buy comfy clothes. So we're going to see what's in here. baby I'm in the toddler section and I ain't got no toddler you get what I'm saying had to check out the sales sales were wonderful one more time for the spritz I've already did it before I got in this car well once I got in the car before I started touching every stuff everything the girl was in there shopping like I was a rich chick um, because in my mind I am a rich chick it's a uh, mental mentality and the more i tell myself that i'm a rich chick the more i become a rich chick okay so um i made some purchases um and i actually um um am very happy with them uh i saw the total and i was like yes you're a rich girl and then when i gave her the discount code baby she said thank you today you saved $368. Girl! So just imagine what that total looked like before I gave her that discount code. Mm -hmm. This rich chick will forever use a discount code. Mm -hmm. This girl got a very nice Calvin Klein winter coat. Okay? Okay? I mean, half length. I'm talking about fur on the inside, fur on the outside, baby. And there is fur all around the hood. Yes, check it out. Check it out. Check out your nearest belt. Um, because I made so much damage in there, I'm going to cut my shopping short. But first, um, before I end the shopping, I'm going to go to Ross. And for like some basics, like shirts like this. Because um, Miss Thickums over here is too big for these shirts my stomach is poking out baby no shame in my game um so let's look for like some basic tees and um then we're going to go to jc Penney's because i want some sweatsuits okay um they told me to go to academy but i don't feel like going to an academy so we're just going to pray that jc Penney's is um has some sales and that they have some sweatsuits um so let's head across the street to the other side where the shopping center is. Oh, Waxahachie is doing great for the shopping. I'm here for shopping in Waxahachie. I'm here for it. I'll be here often. It's like 20 minutes outside of the city of Dallas. So let's go, okay? Because this rich chick is ready to swipe some off. Okay, oh, this is retail therapy, honey. With the sun shining, let's go shopping, y'all. Come with me. Ross it is for some basics, 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 basics. So nothing was really in Ross. I did find like the tops that I was looking for. They came like three in a pack for like $14.99. But I figured I can go to Rainbows, you know. But I walked to JCPenney, 
like I said, I'm not even gonna go in Sephora for what. All I wear is wear the same gold eyeshadow and cheap mascara. So why is this cute rich chick going in Sephora? <laughs> or natural beauties over here, boo-boo. Well, JCPenney's was a bust, but I still had a great day. So, I got my champagne and cranberry juice. It's called a poinsettia. Mm -hmm. Delish. Thanks, Mom, for the glass. <laughs> so, I decided for y'all to see. So, I didn't have to do a separate video. Um, I'm just going to show y'all what I got, okay? <laughs> Help, baby. We're gonna start with the shoes. Some shoes. They're so cute. I was gonna get another pair of shoes, but I was like, girl, you rich, but <laughs> take a break. <laughs> These, oh my god, look at them. You see that chunky heel, baby? Oh, I thought these were adorable. So cute and my man got me a little outfit like a week ago or something like that and i was like trying to figure out what i could wear what shoes i could wear with them i'm hoping that on my birthday and when i wear that outfit it is chilly because he got me an all white little cute outfit and i needed something to go with it so these will be the shoes thank you boo i went and got some shoes just for your fit it will be my birthday fit mm -hmm. oh why mm -hmm. okay and then i got a black pair of boots and they have fur and I'm just going to go to Walmart and get some black tube shoelaces because I don't wear red but these were so cute dope cute mm. so I got some tights y'all in three different colors they were on sale for $6.99 they are thick they are a size large and they have little, you know, texture to them. They are some thickies. You can never have too many tights, especially during the winter time because you can just throw on like an oversized sweater or shirt or something or a little cute blouse, put some boots on cause they're like tight at the bottom. Call it a day. So I got burgundy because that's what I was doing at the shop. I was throwing it in the bag. I love them because they let me keep my hangers. I took everything off the hangers, but I saw the lady in front and she was like, you wanna keep your hangers or not? Girl, give me these hangers. Give me the hangers. I want them. So those are my hangers. So I got this brown sweater. It's too cute. Nice and bohemian looking. Look at the back detail, honey. Yes. So it's just a cute little sweater. You can just throw on at work. Put either a tan or a brown. No zipper or anything, just cute. And I can wear this at work or at home, just out and about, just throw it on. I got this sweater, oversized as usual, cause I just love an oversized sweater. So cute, look at this green. This is giving me, when I saw it, it gave me thrift store vibes. These are these types of sweat. It's not as thick as I want it, but it's definitely thicker than like H&M and Forever 21 and all that kind of stuff. It's thick, it's warm, it's cute, and it's giving me 90s ugly sweater vibe. This is so freaking cute. Look at this, and it's furry. It's like a crop top pullover leopard cheetah whatever you want to call it i think this is cheetah and then it has these little drawstrings and you can draw it in to make it shorter it's cute this is a dress that i probably should not have bought i thought that this dress was going to be cheaper than it was but when she rang it up i didn't feel like telling her to take it off just a long sleeve dress 
flares at the bottom. Excuse my stomach. I told y'all the shirt is too small. Um, and I will be pulling it down all day. So yeah, cute. You can pop, tie this with like some black stockings and some boots. This was so cute. Oh my gosh, another thrift store vibe. It's a pink pullover sweater like, and I bought it too big because once again, I like the pullover. Catch these pearls, honey. Clench them. You know, clench my pearls as I wear them and I probably should wear some studs with them, some pearl studs. I thought it was cute and it reminded me of the headbands that are coming out with the pearls on it. So I might try to find, is that overdoing it? I don't know, but this was adorable. And that's about it on that. Now time for the jacket. Wait, yeah, time for the jacket. This was the ultimate find. It was 50% off of the retail price. And just because it was 50% off, it did not make it cheap. It still was expensive, but I thought it was so worth it. So I found this black Calvin Klein jacket. I'm gonna have to pull y'all back. Hold on real second. Y'all see my black girl booty? Mm -hmm. I made that at Kiki's um, birthday sip and paint. Paint and sip. That part. Let me, let me put this on for y'all real quick. Because this is my first big girl. I'm a woman. I'm 30. I have a career. I make money. I pay my bills. I've got my credit together. And, you know, <laughs> I can afford mid, um, what is it called? I can afford middle class. This is my, I'm in my 30s. I'm a middle class working woman. I take care of my bills. I pay my bills on time. I have my credit. You know, I'm working on my house. This is my jacket right here. It is so nice. You see this fur? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know if this is real. It should be for how much this thinking um, thing costs. You get what I'm saying? I usually have um, fine ones at the thrift store that are all beady beat up, but not this year, baby. Not this year. And then, oh, let me bring you down just a little bit and bring my shirt down, okay? And then I can cinch it in. It gives me the 90s, where is it? I can cinch it in. It gives me those 90s vibes when the ladies' jackets, they were like long. And then you cinch it in and then you zip it up. And that's how you know that I'm grown because my jacket doesn't stop here. But you can cinch it in <laughs> and show the waist. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, this is my rich chick vibes. I freaking love it. I freaking love it. You see my stickers? I still have my stickers, y'all. I'm still planning. Not really. Am, kind of, kind of, sort of, when I want to, because y'all know I don't wear stickers. Let's end this video with this rich lady jacket on. Come close. Okay. It's so hot in here, and the champagne bubbles are getting to me so we're gonna end this video just like this like this my rich mentality because i'm well on my way thank you god for blessing me in 2020 i've been really thinking about i'm about to close this out for real y'all i've really been thinking about making a video towards the end of the year in december reading 2020 to filth okay i'm already starting to write my reads down and thumbs this video up and leave a comment in the book <laughs> and leave a comment in the comment section letting me know if you want to hear me read 2020 to filth okay because it's been lack of a better words shitty okay um let's toast to that let's toast to smiles let's toast to positivity let's post let's post Let's cheers to smiles. Let's cheers to positivity. Let's cheers to all the provisions God has given us. Let's cheers to all the blessings. Let's cheers to our good health. Let's cheers to our family's good health and continue to have good health. Let's cheers to just breathing. And let's cheers because my birthday is in 12 days. So let's cheers to that. I love y'all. I hope I do another video and I will not take 
forever um, to edit this and post this and make another one. So cheers to this and I love y'all. Deuces. Cheers. Clink, clink, clink. Bye y'all. <laughs>